Hi there guys. You have an Android phone and you want to transfer your files onto your Mac with Android transfer file and it's not working. You keep on getting this could not connect to device. Here are some solutions I found online that could help and also what helped for me. Let's get into it. One of the first things to do is try it out your cables. Not all cables are the same. Also, maybe one cable could be um, corrupt or damaged. So basically, check out the cables that they are transfer um, capable. Some of them you can only charge with. Some of them you can data transfer and charge. If you just plug in a cable that enables charging, then you won't be able to transfer your data onto your Mac. You can check this by swiping down. And if you don't get a message where it says that you can uh, use this cable as a data transfer cable, then you have a wrong cable. You need to find the right cable, the original or a data transfer cable. Okay, let's see if this cable is a data cable. Ah, there you go. Straight away you see that you get this pop-up here allowing access to your data from your computer. You press allow so you know this is a data cable and you'll be able to see from from this pop-up uh, menu that the USB file transfer is here enabled and you have some options. Also the connection is important, make sure you have it correctly connected in. Sometimes even if you have like a, a case, you won't be able to stick in the, the, the USB cable all the way in and this could uh, yeah, give you a problem. The next thing I recommend is going into the USB options and making sure that the transferring is uh, toggled on or MTP. Okay, when you have the right cable on, you can choose from the options here and make sure that you have transfer files or Android Auto on. The USB tethering is something else, media is something else, transfer images is something else, and charge only obviously is just charge only. So basically, make sure this is on transfer files. If this doesn't work, I would try to restart the computer. Quite an obvious one, but sometimes we don't think about it. And the following option, if that doesn't work, would be to reinstall the app. So delete the app first and reinstall it again. Sometimes this helps. So and what helped me was by trial and error, I found this out and it's basically this. I'll show you. What helped me was to toggle between connected device and this device. I allowed it and now I can see it on my computer. I hope this helped you in some way and you can now transfer your files onto your Mac. If it did, give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already. Take care, bye.